Hi, this video shows how to systematically monitor these short ALE signals, often lasting just 10 seconds during each 30 minutes, or being even shorter. With help of a sonogram, you can make use from one of the most efficient capabilities of your eye-brain combination, pattern recognition. First, you need an HF file. This has to be presented as a sonogram. Here I did a recording of 2 MHz width for 24 hours. The result gives a first overview on the general HF conditions and local interference. The frequency and time resolution of such a panorama often works fine for monitoring broadcast stations. But to really identify the pattern of short transmissions, you need a better resolution in time and frequency. Secondly, I cut just the 100 kHz aeroband out of the 2 MHz wide recording. At this resolution, I can easily recognize the typical pattern of this 8-channel FSK signal, used with ALE. Now I switch to the player of SDR-COM2 software. Next step is to go through the sonogram in a systematic way. What I did in this video is to find one ALE signal in a 24-hour recording and to follow this channel for the whole time. By pattern recognition you hardly lose any signal on this channel. You should log each signal. I did that with an Excel list sorted by time as I did the monitoring. If you sort the list by call signs, you will find the specifically scheduled soundings of each station. If you don't get each call, there might have been simply no propagation at that time. After scrutinizing this ALE net of US Air Force on 13 to 15 kHz, just catch another signal in the sonogram. You will see, SDR-COM2 software changed monitoring in a way you may have dreamed of. 